Welcome back to Let's Talk Real Estate on 101.5 Sports Radio Lakes Region. Keith Murray here, your producer. And uh, Karina, I thought it would be a good idea for us to learn a little bit more about uh, your business. And we really haven't talked about the Cisneros Realty Group and EXP and, you know, nine months that we've been doing these, That's these right. shows. I mean, you've been very good about bringing, you know, great guests and knowledgeable guests about different aspects of real estate, but we haven't really spent a lot of time talking about your business. And I want to talk a little bit about Zillow in the next few weeks uh, during these segments, but Zillow is one of those internet-based search engines, basically, and a lot of people either find you on Zillow or Trulia, the other one that's owned by Zillow, but um, there's this thing on Zillow that identify you as the best of. What is the best of? I mean, obviously, you look at that and you say, okay, well, you must be one of the best realtors. But really, what does that mean? Well, it means more than it appears to say on its face Mm -hmm. value. Does that that make sense? Yeah. Okay. Well, first of all... I mean, you hear that so many times in business. I'm the best of this. I'm the best of that. And it, it kind of is hollow when you see that. But this is a big deal. It is a big deal. And let me tell you why. Um, so Zillow did not exist 10 years ago. Mm -hmm. Zillow today is the most visited real estate portal in the world. Right. Um, 55% of the business that we do at Cisneros Realty Group this year has come through Zillow. Zillow has been a big part of my growth and success. Uh, and I'm very proud to be a Zillow Premier agent. Mm-hmm. Uh, anybody can be a Zillow Premier agent, but not everybody can be the best of Zillow. And that's important because people that spend marketing dollars on Zillow can become a Premier agent. Or Correct. In my case, when I spend money to market myself, my mortgage services Correct. on Zillow, I'm a Premier loan officer. Correct. So there are 70,000 Premier agents in the country. I was invited along with the top 1,500 Zillow premier agents to the Zillow convention in Vegas about uh, six weeks ago. Mm. So just to get invited, you have to be the top on the top, top of the agents in the country. Cream of the crop. Yes. I'm very proud of that. I, know I'm, I'm, I may be bragging a little bit, but I have worked my butt off. Now, what does it take to become the top level like okay. you are? So it's, first of all... It's not just a number of, n- number of sales. Well, the, no, no. The beautiful thing about being the best of Zillow is that it's the people who I serve mm-hmm. that decide if I am the best of Zillow. Right. And that comes through what's called an experience score. So I have been at 89 in the scale of the experience core score, and my... My, my, my whole purpose, what I've wanted, what I've been striving for is get to 90. <laughs> You're like one percent Just away. one point. <laughs> and I just got to 90 at the end of November. That's great. And that earned me the right to have the label category online best of. So if you go to my profile on Zillow, put Karina Cisneros, or you go to Guilford, Meredith, or Laconia, searching for homes there, you will see that I'm the best of Zillow. So uh, to become the best of Zillow, uh, Zillow will send out a survey 24 hours after somebody from Zillow calls me, Mm -hmm. and they ask, did you connect with Karina? And did did she give you five-star service, four-star service, three-star service? Okay. They also send them another review 15 days later, survey, and another one 45 days later. So you have to be on top of your game with customer service and pay attention to them and just make sure that they're satisfied and they're having a delightful experience. And this is even before you close on a property. Absolutely. This is, this is before. So if I am not on top of my game, they will score me below Mm -hmm. less and less and then i lose my badge right and people will click more on my profile 
because not only do I have now the best of Zillow, but I have 129 five-star reviews on mm. Zillow, which is a big amount because I've been doing this now for five years. And I also have a total of 175 transactions that have been gone through Zillow, okay? So when you add up all those things up and the badge, it places you in a special category. So only 3% of agents nationwide earn the best of Zillow. So, so you're the top 3% in the I, country. I certainly am. I'm proud of it because I worked my butt off to, to give the best service to my clients, earn their trust, their mm -hmm. respect, uh, and I love what I do, and it's fun. So I, my, my goal is to get up to like 94, 95, to be in the top 1%. Okay, so that's the best of Zillow for you. And the best of the best is Corina Cisnero. So I appreciate you uh, explaining that to us, and uh, congratulations on your rating. Well, thank you very much. You're welcome. The next, next time I will explain why this matters even more as Zillow is changing their business model over the next uh, 18 months. And yeah, we look forward to that. Uh, today in the studio, uh, we have Dana Gunnarsson. Thank you for having me. Dana, it's always a pleasure. Why do we have Dana Gunnarsson on our show? Because she knows about insurance. So Dana, what's the biggest discount you offer on home insurance? The biggest one and the, definitely the best one is to bundle your auto with your homeowner's insurance. Um, you can save with our particular company up to 35% off of your home insurance. And then there's also another very significant discount on your auto insurance as well by having them together. Okay. Is there a reason home insurance tends to increase in premium yearly? Well, every year, uh, insurance companies try to keep up with the cost of building materials and labor. So they have to keep up with it by increasing the replacement cost of your house, which means what they're going to pay out when, God forbid, something happens to your house to rebuild it. So it does tend to creep up. I always say, call your agent, do a review, and see how you can get it You know, back down to something a little bit more reasonable. Okay, so let's say I insure my house. Mm -hmm. But I've heard about an umbrella policy. Yes. So I've been told it's good to have an umbrella policy because it covers more. What more does it cover usually and is it worth having an umbrella policy? So an umbrella policy is somebody who has a lot of assets. So what you want to do is sit down with your agent, figure out what you have for assets, what your net, net worth is, and then your liability insurance should be up and above that. So once you figure out how much you have to protect, then you have to figure out you know, if the umbrella makes sense for you. And it's usually $1 million to $5 million, depending on you know, the insurance needs. And it's not very expensive. $1 million, you know, can run you anywhere between $180 to a couple hundred dollars, depending on the situation. So for a million dollars worth of coverage, it's not that expensive. And it's peace of mind. What do we need to know about insurance and roofs? I would say the most important thing about roofs that you should keep in mind is the fact that they might inspect your home in the first 30 days until you need to replace yours in order to keep the insurance in place. So make sure that you are aware if your house is going to be inspected. Make sure that you know the condition of your roof. And if you do replace your roof, you get a discount for doing so. Okay. And between metal roofs and shingle roofs, what does the insurance say? So metal roofs are less to insure, but they also cost more to do. So the overall replacement cost of your dwelling would go up a little bit, but they give you a discount for it. So it's actually a little bit less expensive to have a metal roof. Plus you're one and done. So that's okay. Thanks for sharing that. Okay. Join me next Saturday morning at 830 for another episode of Let's Talk Real Estate where we share important information that will help you with either buying or selling your home. And if you or someone you know is looking to purchase a new home or sell, call me, Karina, at 603-273-6160 for a free market valuation of your home. You can also visit us at our website, nhlakeshomes.com. And visit us on Facebook. You can also listen to our show's podcast on iTunes and Google Play. And remember, mi casa es su casa. 
And my name is Karina. Like the song Karina Karina. Until next week, play my song. Karina Karina. Karina Karina. Karina Karina. I love you so. Let's Talk Real Estate is presented by the Cisneros Realty Group, powered by EXP Realty, and sponsored by Dana Gunnarsson of the Joe Suazo Allstate Insurance Office, Hudkins Law Title and Settlement, and NCT Nano Coating Technologies. Let's Talk Real Estate is a production of Modern Media LLC, CRG TV, and MR Strategic Alliance All Rights Reserved. Join us every Saturday morning at 8.30 for Let's Talk Real Estate with Karina Cisneros on 101.5 Sports Radio, Lakes Region.